Hi, it's me again with Corel Doll Tips and Tricks. And today's video is going to be about playing around with the corner radius, which is right up here when you click on an object. And right up here to the left of that radius, you have rounded corners, you have scallop corners, you have minor corners or chamfered corners. And this is pretty common practice to uh, miter them or you know radius them a quarter of an inch you know, an inch, you get rounded corners. But what if you, you go to the max and you type in 100? It wouldn't take 100 to get there. 25 would do it. But you could type in 100 and it'll do that. Now you could also hit the scallop corners and look what you get. And then it, this one's not as good, but the chamfered corners and you get a the rectangle turn at a degree. But let's take this shape right here, and that's how I drew this shape. I'm going to fill it in with a color just for the video. And I'm going to control D and I'm going to make a duplicate of it, and I'm going to rotate it 45 degrees. And then I'm going to select it all. I'm going to go up to arrange and combine it. Now, I mainly do my stuff for laser engraving, so we just work with black and white and gray. But that's a pretty cool effect that you can do and, and do a lot with it. Let's just back up here where we just have one. Make sure we just have one and control. Let's move it over a little bit. Control D. Holding down the control button when you get the double, the double arrow. And you could continue with that forever and make a pretty cool design. So that's your corner radius. Hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.